morning and welcome to Morning Magazine, our RFES morning show. Today is Monday, October 25th. It's Rotation Day 1. Um, I'm your anchor, John M. Let's get our day started with the Pledge of Allegiance and the Code of Conduct. Doing the pledge today are students from Ms. Donnellan's class. Please introduce yourselves. I just read it off the screen. Sorry. Okay. Please stand for the pledge. Landon, Chloe, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Rogers Forge Code of Conduct. I am a Rogers Forge student. Therefore, I am respectful, I am responsible, I am safe, I am prepared. We are here to learn. Therefore, I will do nothing to keep my teachers from teaching or anyone else from learning. I will cooperate with my school family. I will respect myself, others, and the environment. Please be seated. Well, we got a little technical difficulty there. Well, good morning. It's me, Mr. Holden, sitting in for Mrs. Fanshaw and sometimes Mrs. Witchy Poo because sometimes she comes on, especially considering what's coming up this week. I hope you listened carefully uh, to the morning announcements on Friday talking about specific things that are important to remember with regards to the Halloween parade. And I know things are being sent home too, so make sure that you uh, note that. Also of note, Red Ribbon Week kicks off, and we're going to have a special message from uh, Claire S. coming up today, and she's going to be telling us all about that. All in all, we want you to get your week off to a great start, so remember that code of conduct, okay? And we'll look forward to seeing you around the halls having an awesome Monday. Now, I'm going to kick it over to Archer, who has our birthdays for today. And you know what? Thankfully, my, my trusty staff has reminded me we do have Peacemaker, so great job, Morning Magazine crew. First of all, uh, our first Peacemaker of the day is Xavier. Xavier is a first grader, and Xavier was nominated by Kingston for the virtue of friendliness by making him a paper at indoor recess. How nice that was. So thanks. Good job, Xavier. Also, we have it's a family affair today because we have Max Ortiz, Max O, who's in second grade, and Max was nominated by his sister Sophia, as shown the virtue of love by always being kind to his sister. How nice. Meanwhile, Sophia has been nominated by Clara in the fifth grade, has shown the virtue of kindness by helping her when she doesn't quite know what to do. That's all, always good to have somebody to help. And no surprise here, Mr. Leibowitz, he's actually got a couple of nominations coming up nominated by Lily in the fifth grade on our news crew here for being a great substitute. And I know a lot of people feel the same way. Susie S. Uh, has been nominated by her teacher, Mrs. Osgood, has shown the virtue of responsibility by helping to take care of the classroom without being asked and is a good role model. Way to go, Susie. Jeffrey Z. in the first grade, nominated by Mila in Miss Delgatti's class, has shown the virtue of love by helping, helping her up and she fell on the playground. And last but not least, Arena G in Mrs. Rickles' third grade class, nominated by Sophie, who's shown the virtue of friendliness by just, in general, being kind. Thanks for those great Peacemaker nominations. And now it's time to take a look at birthdays with Archer. Time to take a look at birthdays today. We want to wish Luke F. a happy birthday. As he is celebrating, don't forget to go down to the office for your birthday pencil and have a great day. We're so excited to see so many people wearing pajamas today. Tomorrow's crazy hat day. Hats off to celebrate hats off to, to good choices. Wear your crazy hat to show you can 
show you can make healthy choices and be kind. We want to thank you for joining us today on Morning Magazine. Let's get our Monday off to an amazing start. Don't forget to tune in tomorrow for another great show. For my birthday reporter, Archer H., I'm John M., wishing you a great day.